tidy. So guess what? Listen. So if you're reading a tidy, you understand what's going to happen today. If you don't know, let me know. All right, you guys. I have a condition called acid reflex. And when you have acid reflex, there are a list of foods that you're supposed to stay away from. Where I was dibbling and dabbling and I didn't stay away and I had an episode. So everyone, um, body reacts differently and some of the foods on the list my body does not have any type of reaction to at all but your girl had an episode and i was down for like i'm gonna say a week i'm gonna say a week um it was even hard to drink water like when i drank the water and it hit my stomach it was like what you do like i literally felt like my body was like my stomach was trying to come out my body like girl what is this like drinking water so i was a man down i couldn't work out for like i didn't work out for seven days because as i was getting better i didn't have the energy because also uh tmi <laughs> i was having diarrhea really bad and so everything i was eating which i couldn't eat much was like soup i was eating soup i had a little bit of salad but it was mainly soup and water that's it and I was just trying to hydrate myself because I was having diarrhea and I mean severe diarrhea all day every day for like days until I had to get some emodium because I usually it would stop after day or two but it didn't so I was like oh this is going a little too long and I don't want to go in the hospital and for dehydration or anything like that so I had to get some emodium to get your girl's stomach right because baby it was Neither here nor there, it's Saturday morning. It's about 7 o'clock in the morning. You know how your parents get up in the morning to clean? That's what I'm doing. You may hear my washing machine going in the back. Uh, you might see a lot of light in the back. I'm actually going to be washing my curtains throughout my house because, you know, the weather is changing. So every season, I like to wash my curtains. So that's what I'm doing at this moment. I'm drinking some hot raspberry tea with a lemon and I have one of those, like, blue raspberry sugar-free packs in it. I don't like tea. But I like the warmth of the tea. I like flavored tea, um, but I still have to add something to it to make me really like it. So, and I have a lemon in here. Um, so, that's what I'm drinking on. That's what we got going on. So, today is a reset day for the week, you guys. I was able to work out twice this week. I'm going to work out today, this morning, after I finish cleaning up the front of my house. Um, and then I'm going to work out. I'm going to cook some breakfast. I'm going to show y'all bits of my workout and I'm going to show you bits of what I'm going to eat for breakfast because I don't know and then what we're going to do oh we're going to get dressed because I have a BJ's pickup I have to go to the grocery store I got to go to Trader Joe's I got to go to Aldi's it's going to be a little grocery haul in the mix and later on I'm going to an event I may show snippets of it um I decide to go by myself if I don't know like sometimes I just want to do things by myself and I want to tell people I did nothing wrong to want to do things by yourself um Sometimes you just don't want the headache or not the headache. Like, you just want to do something by yourself. Like, you know, I don't know how to explain the feeling, but neither here nor there. Um, I bought my ticket yesterday, so I will be going to see a live band tonight. That's going to be my logistics of what I'm going to be doing today. Um, we will be eating out. Don't know where. Oh, also, let me tell y'all. So, I decided on Friday, oh, I'm going to eat at one of my favorite food carts i'm not doing that i have to realize that my, one i have to stop eating the things that's tearing me up and maybe because i i had diarrhea again last night tmi so like that so i was like oh no tanisha so my major things because i went off of the loom come back is dairy products tomato products that's my main things when it comes to acid reflux. Other things don't bother me. In reality, a lot of things I'm going to put on the screen that you're not supposed to eat. It's a lot of, mostly it's like processed meat, dairy, citrus, tomatoes. They say pasta, but the pasta I get doesn't bother. Like I said, everyone has their different things. Um, so I'm going to be reducing a lot of processed foods in my diet. I've already lost three pounds. Um, yeah since last week um they tell you when you get acid reflux that you need to change your diet to a bland diet as they call it but people don't really know what it is until you realize what affects you what you got to change out of your diet and it's not a diet as in like you on a diet it's like your lifestyle like you have to or that baby you're going to be hurting 
you gonna be hurting. When I tell you I was man down, my mama was this close to drive up here. But I'm like, mom, all right, which I was. I just literally couldn't do much. But neither here nor there. We here again today. So um, I'm gonna get some groceries and about a week, about a what, week or two, and I gotta pick up. Um, a BJ's pickup to go do. I got to get a few things for Trader Joe's as well as a few things for Sam's Club because they do not have those things at BJ's. All right. Okay. Um. Oh, I also, I told y'all my machine, washing machine, it is washing. It's Saturday morning. It's time to get this house together. It's your boy, it's your boy. And it's time to go out. I don't know how I'm going to do my hair, y'all. This is literally me. I woke up like this. I woke up like this. I woke up like this. So, basically. So, I just have on a little red robe. You know how your mom used to do on Saturday? Just like that, okay? So, basically, I can't be doing a whole bunch of processed food. So, my goal is to only have one processed food a day. Whether it's only going to be on my snack or it's going to be in my meals. Like pasta or something like that. But, that's my whole goal. A lot of my snacks I was eating, oh, things that bother me too. Like when you have chips, anything that has like like, like sour cream and onion, that stuff has milk in it. And that te the chips don't tear me up. It's the sauce because when I get regular chips, nothing. When I get barbecue chips, nothing. It's those sour cream, them cheddar chips. Maybe by the next day, I'll be man down. So, when I come back, you're going to see me cook some breakfast. I'm about to drink this tea down, clean up. I'm cleaning out my refrigerator at this moment, wiping and stuff. And I'm going to wash some dishes. And then, no, I'm cleaning my refrigerator. Then I'm going to cook. Then we're going to wash some dishes. Then we're going to clean up the house. And then I should be ready to work out. And then get ready to hit these streets. But, guess what I need to do? Click. That notification bell because your girl gonna be on it. Oh, I do have some hauls coming. I did say in my last vlog that I purchased a clothing rack, baby. They canceled it, and I tried to get it for another store and they canceled it. So I have to buy me a clothing rack this week. I'm gonna get one today, and I'm going to um, I have a haul. It's gonna be an old navy HM mixed with a little bit of Macy's. Was it Macy's or Dillard's? I think it was Dillard's. I got those shoes. But yeah, y'all know the fall's coming in. I'm gonna have some old hauls. I just been looking. So we got stuff to do. Ah. Guess what? I want y'all to go back and look at videos y'all haven't seen. Please support your girl. I'm gonna be more it's like two videos a week. I already posted one yesterday. I will be posting one today. I think I'm gonna post one on Sunday. <laughs>
out for lunch. I haven't worked out yet, but my house is clean. So, what we're going to do, we're going to do five ounces of this brisket that I got from my parents, smoked brisket. We're going to do some mashed potatoes that I already cut and some raw carrots. We're going to put it on this plate. We're going to put it in the microwave, and that's going to be for lunch. So, I'm going to try to do about four to five ounces of the mashed potatoes, and we're going to do five ounces of the brisket with some carrots and a little bit of reduced sodium gravy, you guys. So, let's put this together. It is going to be... Turn on some lights and let's go. Let's go. We're going to have 100 grams of these carrots, and we're going to have 5 ounces of this mashed potatoes. We just have gravy. I didn't wait to gravy. I just put it up there. This is going to be lunch. Alright, you guys. So, I'm dressed. So, all I did, I did flat twist my hair, and then I flat twist it down this way. So, I'm going to let it dry. I just put a little moisturizer on my hair. Hold on, you guys. It's a little fussy. I put a little bit of hair moisturizer on my hair no water so it can dry quickly so it can be ready for tonight how about my glasses i have on this black college hat that i got a couple of years ago this i have on a black tank top y'all can see i have on some jogging pants and i have on a pair of sneakers that's it that's all we're going real chill today regular silver hoops lip gloss that's it that's all this african print brand i got from a event i went to i think it's like ten dollars good price so let's go ahead and get the bar rolling you guys you know you got some smell good on no makeup because we're not doing that okay so guess what it's time to go my stuff is already ready all right you guys so i got my stuff from bj's now we about to hit aldi i got my list oh y'all i'm struggling i'm struggling hold on my stomach growling like it's it's on e so I have my list. This is my list. We're going to get that together. But before we go in, we're going to eat an apple. Because the way this stomach is going, I don't want to go in there and get stuff I do not need. It's not on my list. So let me eat this apple. And that's a juicy apple. But I got a list. John, we're going to go to Trader Joe's. All right, y'all, we in Aldi. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm gonna get two of these. pick up my seasoning but listen i'm at trader joe's trader joe's this is what i'm getting that's it that's all if i come out with more y'all be like ah, ah. so i'm going to get some blackened seasoning i need i'm gonna get some of them oat milk ice cream sandwiches for dessert i'm going to get um my mandarin chicken for like a quick meal if i need to have a quick meal i gotta get some sunscreen and i gotta get some probiotics that's it that's all that's it that's all oh, i'm gonna get a water from in here because i'm parched um that's it that's all i'm not coming back without nothing else okay told y'all so in and out then we're gonna get back all right you guys i'm finally back home we're gonna start with the stuff that's right here in front of me and then we're gonna work our way into the kitchen everything has been disinfected wiped down so let's get started 
we end up getting the fair life shake you guys this is dairy free we have the um body armor light drinks i love these a thing of water and we also have this variety pack of skinny pop this is my favorite it only comes out during the halloween time because i like the kettle corn and the regular popcorn white cheddar and of course the basic skinny pop all right so we're gonna get into it first we're gonna go through our trader joe's and then we're gonna get into the rest of the stuff did y'all see y'all see that Woo! it was a kind of a big grocery haul this time so let's get into it we're gonna first start out with this man it was chicken i told you guys that i was gonna get but guess what guys they only had four left i grabbed two because i'm gonna go ahead and put one in the oven for dinner tonight um i got those two they're like four dollars some chains a pack i got these non-dairy oat milk ice cream bars they're good i also got these dot chocolate peanut butter cups you guys this is only 99 cents i just want to have something in the house um three pieces is 190 so okay i can have one every now and then but i wanted something different i never had dark chocolate um peanut butter cups so boom i didn't want to get a big container and plus this is only 99 cents all right and i also got the trader joe's probiotics like i told y'all they didn't have the um uh, spf i got this rice wine vinegar for the shrimp lo mein as well as i got this big thing of alkaline water i'm gonna drink with electrolytes all right now let's get into the rest it's a list but we're gonna start off we're gonna start off we i'm trying to find a place to put y'all y'all because i had to clean everything can y'all see yeah, you can all right so all right so here i had to get a bag of chicken wings they also had a coupon for five dollars off bj's website you can't beat that i also get my chicken thighs from BJ's because it's cheaper. Audi, they be playing around. And you get this big family pack, you guys. This is only $12. If you get it from Audi, you're going to get six for like $7. I got two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten for $12. So that's all I'm going to say on that. I got this salmon from Audi's, two pieces. I got this lean ground beef. This is the only, they had a 93, then they had a 96, I didn't want a 96. I got these eggs from BJ's because it was cheaper. This was like $4 for these, 2 dollars um, Audi, pineapple chunks, mango chunks is going to be for smoothies. I got a bag of onions. We got some shrimp, of course, for the shrimp lo mein. This is the jumbo Audi. I was able to find this grain, 12 grain whole wheat. This is what I was looking for at Audi. And the stuff you saw before that I could not find. Uh, but I was able, somebody put it to the side. So I picked it up. Okay? All right. That's it. That's all. I got some brown sugar. Some, I use this type of barbecue sauce for like my meatloaf. And when I do like ribs or something like that, I do sweet baby rays or I make a homemade sauce. Frozen vegetables. I got two bags of peas. And I got two bags of mixed vegetables because I already have some frozen vegetables in there as well. I got two boxes of these. This is almond whole almonds. And then I got two boxes. One box of this and then one box of the almond walnuts. It's 100 calories. Something to put in your lunch bag as well as in your purse on the go. We got some carrots. If y'all don't know, I love carrots. And plus we need some for the lo mein. I was out of rice. Ooh, ooh. I was out of rice, you guys, so I got this big thing of white rice, $2 Audi. I got some almond milk, unsweetened 30 calorie. If you want to start almond milk, try to go with the one with the with the more with more calories and will have more fat and things in it. And you might want to do sweeten. Uh, but I worked my way down um, to unsweetened 30. Okay? Just FYI. Because I didn't like it at first. And I realized I had to start up and then work my way down. All right, so we got some bananas. We got two cans of albacore white and water. We got the quinoa because I'm going to make those quinoa bowls. This girl on TikTok, I'm going to try to link it if I can. When I make it and not post it, I'm going to see if I can link her for somehow link it. I don't know how I'm going to do that. I got some chopped walnuts because I'm supposed to be making them pumpkin. Let me get it out. Pumpkin muffins off TikTok is like 125 calories. And 
you only use two ingredients to to put it together that includes 100% puree pumpkin and a box of mix I haven't got there yet and she put like cinnamon night like, sugar and brown sugar on top which I'm gonna do but I'm also gonna put some of these chopped walnuts to give it a little texture that I like we got some grapes because they was on sale for 95 cents at Aldi we got two avocados because we're gonna make some avocado toast with that 12 grain toast y'all saw we got some mushrooms for the stir fry we got some peppers we got some broccoli we got some cabbage spinach we have one thing of blueberries i end up getting two things of raspberries and two things of blackberries and i also got a can of black beans all right so let me go ahead and put this up. I have to work out. So while I'm working out, this food going to be in the oven. I'm going to put on some of these peas. And I'm going to do that man and chicken right in the oven. And I'm going to work out. It's only a 30 minute total body workout. So I'm about to, y'all about to see a little bit of that. And then after that, um, I'm going to eat and then I'm going to get dressed. The thing doesn't start to 8.30. Doors open at 7, I think. So I'm going to try to be there about 8. So that's the whole goal. I think it's like 5 now almost close to five so i got time i really don't have to rush my outfit i don't know my outfit i got my outfit but my hair i'm really feeling a hat day so even though i got this like flat twist in the front y'all low key i think i might swoop all this hair back in a nice little tight bun have a head on big hoops do a little bit with the face crop top cargo pants sneakers I think I'm going to do it like that. Real chill. I'm going to be standing up for hours anyway. And so, let's get into it. That's going to be the outfit for later. I'm for sure it's going to be the outfit because I'm telling y'all, it's going to be the outfit. But, um, yeah, that's going to be the outfit. <laughs> clothes and work out remember life is about balance so don't be coming for me talk about oh you eating yeah life is about balance so we're gonna go ahead and nibble on them these are really good i actually like them better than Reese goes i'm gonna tell you why the Reese cup is wider this it's taller. It's a better contrast with the dark chocolate and the peanut butter. I don't know how they did the peanut butter. Then the super sweet chocolate with the super sweet peanut butter in the normal Reese cup. That's why I like this. The dark chocolate got a little punch. Mm-hmm. And the peanut butter come and smooth it out. Like Mm-hmm. This is a great find. Y'all go 
Don't get this when y'all go to Trey Joe's. <laughs> Yeah, I see this sweat 30 minute total body workout. I was lifting 10s and 15s. It's time to eat. So in the middle, y'all saw before I did that. In the middle, the food was done. Where I took the um, chicken out, did what I had to do. So now we're about to plate the peas already and eat, shower, get dressed, get into them streets. I made sure that I had the chicken cooking while I was working out because I knew. I wasn't going to have time to do both at separate times. So, it's going to be dinner. Dinner is served. 200 grams of this uh, mandarin chicken and two cups of peas. That's it. That's all. I'm go ahead and eat this. Y'all know what I said. Shower. Clothes on. Pair if I'm going to do it. Let's ask you a little bit. <laughs> 